Want to know how you can find your partner with these five bay leaves? Then keep watching. As the occasion of Valentine's is knocking on the doors, we want to explore how love is celebrated in different ways across the world. Perhaps these give you some excellent ideas for this year. Number one, Romania. If you're looking for a romantic and out of the box idea for Valentine's Day, then definitely the Romanians will not disappoint you. It is a mix between the Valentine's Day and the celebrations of the spring season. What a combo. Young men and women go to the forests to pick up colorful flowers after their engagement. But the tradition does not stop there. The couples also wash their faces with fresh snow. This is considered to bring good luck and happiness in their relationship. Wild flowers and snow to celebrate love. I wonder how the gift shops in Romania do business. Number two, Japan. When it comes to celebrating love, Japan has developed its own unique way. They have reversed the tradition, hey thanks, compared to the rest of the world. In Japan, it is the woman who bear the pressure of giving gifts. The favor is then returned exactly one month later on March 14th on a day known as the White Day, when men are encouraged to give gifts back to the women who treated them on the Valentine's Day. So how this tradition came into existence? In the 1950s, when Valentine's Day was first being introduced in Japan, bakeries and large departmental stores ran nationwide advertisement campaigns for giving gifts to the loved ones on 14th of February. The target customers were women, who were encouraged to buy beautiful and delicious gifts for the men in their lives. And thus, this unique Valentine's culture in Japan started as an offspring of their corporate advertisement. Guys, if you like our videos, then please give us a thumbs up and share our videos. Please consider subscribing to our channel and do not forget to hit the bell button. You can also choose to follow us on our social platforms for which the links are given below. Number 3. South Korea They say when you're in love, every day is a Valentine's Day. No people hold it more true than the South Koreans. Well, they don't actually celebrate Valentine's every day, of course. But they have designated the 14th of each month for celebrating love. In fact, Valentine's Day is one of 12 love days celebrated on the 14th of every month in South Korea. These days range from the popular White Day or depressing Black Day and everything in between. The tradition of the Valentine's Day and the White Day is similar to that of the Japanese culture and Black Day is celebrated by the singles who did not receive any gift on the Valentine's Day and White Day. What are the other nine days of the year you ask? They are the Dairy Day, the Rose Day, the Kiss Day, Silver Day, Green Day, the Photo Day, Wine Day, Movie Day, Hug Day. Number 4. Spain In Valencia, Spain, the Day of Love is celebrated on 9th of October. This date is known as the Day of Saint Dionys, the patron saint of the people in love. It's a tradition to eat candy made of marzipan. Men give the velvet scarf as gifts to their girlfriends or wives. Many Valencian women wear these scarves as a symbol of love during their relationship. Isn't that romantic? Often the marzipan candy is directly wrapped in those scarves, which is called La Mocadora. Every year, the candy makers of Valencia prepare hundreds of thousands of marzipan figurines. In fact, it is estimated that about 70,000 kilos of marzipan can be used to make these beautiful and delicious figures. Also, contests are arranged to give rewards to the best candy maker and the best figurines. Number 5. China They say everything is fair in love and war. From the beginning of time, many people have tried many ways to win love. But the Miao girls from China found the shortest path to love. The oldest of such traditions in China is known as the Sisters Meal Festival. This is celebrated by the Miao people who live in the southeast of Gyangsu province. 
The festival is celebrated with multicolor rice dishes dyed with natural wild flowers, delicately prepared for the men. The women dress up in traditional colorful dresses, adorn themselves with intricate silver jewelry, and play singing and dancing games with their lover or love interest. So what's the origin of such traditions? There were two sisters whose son and daughter grew up together and they fell in love with each other at youth. But the girl's parents insisted that she should marry someone else. The girl refused to do so and the boy didn't want to marry another girl. To avoid being found out that they are still in love, they always met outdoors. The girl always took delicious rice for the boy when they met. Finally though, the girl's parents were moved and said yes to their marriage. And since then, the Muir girls started celebrating this wonderful tradition of celebrating love. Number 6. England Many women in England still follow an age-old tradition which dates back centuries. The night before Valentine's Day, the woman used to place five bay leaves dipped in rose water under their pillow before they went to sleep. According to legend, the woman who follows this formula will dream of her future husband. The sprinkling of rose water on the leaves is believed to make the appearance of their sweetheart even more certain. Wow, what a way to check the psychic ability of love. Although it's not known where this tradition originated from, but nonetheless, it is probably one of the most interesting ways to find love around the world. So how did you celebrate Valentine's Day last year? Or have you ever tried to celebrate Valentine's in a unique way? Please let us know by commenting below. Number 7. Wales Chocolate, cards, teddy bear, roses. What comes to your mind thinking about Valentine's gifts? If you choose one of these most popular options, then tough luck my friend, if you are in Wales. These gifts are a big no-no in Wales when it comes to showing love to your loved one. But what do they gift to their lovers then? A spoon. A what? Yes, you heard it right. It's a love spoon. These are intricately crafted wooden spoons, traditionally made by the men to show affection to their lady love. Now that is some serious dedication to love. This culture is still popular on Valentine's Day in Wales, which is actually celebrated on January 25th. This is because in Wales, the day of love is celebrated honoring their local patreon, Saint of Lovers, San Dwynwen. Love spoons are also popular as gifts for marriages as well as anniversaries. Can the love spoons be used as actual spoons? Perhaps yes, but we think they are more decorative than their actual functions. Hey Vihan, I thought you brought a gift for me today. There you go. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Next week, we'll be back with something strange, something different or something amazing. Till then, stay curious and keep hunting.